the Lord of Jesus is my personal Savior. So the Father is your personal Savior? Because Jesus in his earthly ministry is constantly referring to God the Father. But wait a minute. The Quran says Allah is a father to no one. Say, it is only God who deserves all praise. He has not begotten a son and has no partner in his kingdom. In Islam, Allah cannot be referred to as a father in any sense of the word, whether it's physical or metaphorical. Referring to Allah as a father is bidah or innovation and is haram. Congratulations, Mufti. You just committed bidah. Welcome, Kafir. He is my personal savior. The creator of myself and entire creation is my personal savior. I have a personal relationship with him. I talk to him. I know him. He knows me. And we talk and he tells me his message. I have it in front of me, but I constantly complain to him about my weakness and seek forgiveness directly from him. He is Allah. The Quran is very clear that the only type of relationship you have with Allah is that of a slave or a servant and a master. The personal relationship that you just described sounds a lot like Christianity, the relationship Christians have with Christ. You don't have that with Allah. You are simply Abdullah, a slave of Allah. That's why Allah says, La billah. Don't associate partners with Allah. You are a worshiper. We made you worship us alone. That's funny because you just said the Lord of Jesus is your personal savior. Who is the father which would be associating partners with Allah? If you worship us alone and come, we might ignore everything else and give you paradise. Us? Royal we or Trinity? Anyways, Mufti Make, please stop committing bidah or I'm going to have to start calling you my favorite Christian preacher.